it's done. So I'm live right now. Doing my live thing. I made all these coils live. So if you really want to watch them, you have seven days. Justin.tv forward slash RWG research. And you can watch this for seven days. I think today is the 15th. Uh, 115.12. EPG coils are done. I'm so excited because it is so time for this stuff to be done. And um, now it's going to be time for me to take this machine apart. So, just so you know, Hawk, this is officially the Hawk Winder, just so you know. So, good job, buddy. Um, so yeah, so uh, let's get started because I'm going to try to make a lot of stuff in this footage. And what I'm going to do is uh, disassemble this thing. So for those of you who haven't seen this machine or you want to see more of it or whatever, you're going to just have to check out my past videos. I do a big demo of this. Um, but what I wanted to show you now is how this thing comes apart. So that's what I'm going to do. So first of all, the O-band, which is on the back side, Okay, pops apart. Okay, now I have the old band in my hand. There's one little terminal here that you unscrew and pull this thing out of here. One piece at a time. This old band wrapped all of these coils. This is the only thing I spent money on making this machine was this O-band and it's actually jewelry bead, the stretchy stuff you know and then on the ends here I did this to make four wraps but on the ends here I took this coupling okay and this just screws together that's how I make my my coupling so, got this off. Alright, that's my band. Next thing I'm going to do is unscrew these two screws here. Come off. Like so. One. Now, as you guys know, I'm going to show you what's in here because I don't know, I'm sure I did this before, but a few people were asking me questions. All this is is a piece of metal. That's all it is. It just holds the rim straight. That's it. Alright, and then this piece lifts up so that I can take this out. There you go, rims off of it. And now I have an EPG. Oh this thing this thing actually weighs a lot. So let me get this let's see it zoomed all the way out. There we go. So, Russ with his EPG in hands, first time. Thank you guys for allowing me to build this, because without your support, I wouldn't have been able to do it. And I'm not just stating that for fun, I'm stating it because I really appreciate it. I have this old scale here, and I'd like to see how heavy this thing is. I don't know if I can get this hook on here. There we go. Alright. Any guesses? Twenty three twenty-three and a half pounds. I can't really hold it with one arm that high in the air anyway. I can hold it down here just fine. Twenty-three and a half pounds of copper. There you go. So, um, yeah, where to, uh, as a necklace. So, now, 
it's time to put some terminal connectors on there. I got these terminal connectors and I'd like to put in each one of these terminal connectors will have a wire and with that wire I will be able to hook it up in series parallel and test the different theories. So that's the idea behind each one of these being hooked up. I plan on putting some dowels. Um, I'm just this is actually for the finished product, but I'm gonna I think I'm just gonna hot glue a dowel or two around the inside here, and then that'll allow me to uh, uh, just glue these to those dowels, and then when I'm done, I can just wire it how it needs to be. Now, one thing that you guys need to understand and you need to pay attention to. I thought for sure on Stan's device uh, that these coils here were different, but those are the same amount of wire. This is the same amount of wire on three pipes as it is four pipes. If you're like this, you can kind of see the difference. But if you're up here, you can't really tell. So it's kind of interesting. So. We'll be back. Hopefully I'll get these wired up. I'll record what I get done tonight on the live show. And that's it for now. This might be the end. It might not. <sighs> yeah. So, here's what I've been doing. Um temporarily I have placed some wood dowel rods I was gonna make them round I decided just to cut them because I had to get them all wet and try to bend them didn't really want to do that so there they are so I have terminals on every single one of those um, and they're all just hot glued on there and now I'm gonna start soldering so I wanted to show you what I did in case I don't get done soldering and this will be the end I don't know if it will be the end. If it is, hey, thanks. If it's not, see you in a little bit. Ta da! Da, 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 da. Electrical connections complete. It is really late. Pretty tired. Still got to do some video editing. There it is. See what the bottom looks like. I'm get my fingers under it. Each one of these is soldered to a terminal block all the way around. And there it is. And that was probably extremely close, I know. And uh, yeah, so EPG testing can begin. Now, I do, and I am going to, I should say, um, use the Hawk Winder to rewrap this coil set. Um, the reason I want to do that is because I don't think the length of the coils are all the same. So I would like to redo that um, to make sure that those are exactly the right length. Because if you look, this one looks real full and this one don't. and I could wrap them a lot neater too. That won't really take much time, but I'm going to do it. So that's it. The end of the live show. After show, which is kind of during show. Whatever. So the day of Russ. That's what this was. Um, today is the 16th. 1 16 12. I started this project a long time ago. And now I've gotten this far. <laughs> So there you go, rwgresearch.com, this is Russ, check out um, alexpetty.com, 
Also check out open-source-energy.org and any other links in the description. And I'm going to do some video editing and I'm off to bed. It's probably going to take about an hour and a half to get this footage where I'd like it. So yeah. Woo! See if it says I'm panning too fast. Probably not because I'm actually in the footage. Whee! Alright. Peace out guys. Thanks for your support. It's much appreciated. It's definitely needed. And uh, it's still needed. There's so much more testing that needs to be done. Alright. Have a good one. Peace and love to you all. Blessings. See ya. Oh, there's your answer. It doesn't work. Ha 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 ha!